Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Aries. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. Aries, are you looking at your options, thinking about your options? If this is not you, it's definitely them. But um, I feel like you have options here. There's you know, three fish here. So you definitely have more than one option. Um, although there is one that seems to be larger than the others. Um, and so there is one that is, <clears throat> that means more to you than the others. Um, I feel like there's one that you would like to expand uh, on um, or with. And uh, you could be thinking about this person and maybe uh, hoping to expand on uh, somebody's feelings, expand on the relationship, um, and maybe hoping for a lucky break. Um, we have the forgotten on this in the reverse. This is what it looks like in the upright. All right, but uh, you have it in the reverse. Um, it is uh, being represented uh, by Earth, um, and so you could be trying to use logic and reason um, uh, when it comes to your options. Uh, you could be very, very focused on your options at this time. Um, the Forgotten uh, is a very powerful card that can signal an irrefutable defeat. It can indicate that somebody's negative feelings and, and anxieties have put you in a situation where everything seems uh, unfixable, um, like you have nothing left to give and nowhere else to go. But with the darkest hour comes the inevitable dawn, and now the day can begin anew. But this won't happen without some effort on your part. Now is the time to make a change. You may have given up on somebody, uh, or they have given up on you because of negative thinking, and, and, and that that mentality is what has put you here looking at your options is what I feel that this is about. Okay. Um, and I feel like you're restless. Um, you're tired of sitting here alone by yourself or with the, uh, the hermit in the reverse. Okay. Um, I feel like it's like and we got this queen of swords, her sword's up, she's a little guarded, maybe a little a little miffed with this person, and she wants to talk about uh, the relationship here. This is something she's thinking about, she's looking back, but she's actually, this one here looks forward, so she's looking back and thinking about a past situation, feeling a little restless, looking at her options, but she really wants, there's one that stands out more than the others, and it's this one she wishes to talk to. <laughs> <laughs> about maybe uh, recovery, um, making something better, uh, healing, whatever this is. Um, so, and I mean, it could be with these flowers that you're going to get your wish. It could be with these flowers that they are going to come to you and that there will be a recovery. You may even receive flowers or some other kind of a gift in the future. I feel like somebody's sitting really stubbornly. This is this person that they're talking about. This person that um, they have a lot of anxieties. There's a lot of negative feelings um, when it comes to love connections in general, I feel. It could be that it could be that they think maybe you're nice to them just to get something. This comes from their own ghosts because we do have death here and this is about them needing to face these fears um so they they set you aside you know 
they set you aside um, and they're sitting very stubbornly in this energy but um, they're thinking about you they're thinking about you as much as you are thinking about them if not more okay because you you're looking at your options I feel like you have other options although your mind will always come back to this one okay and they are thinking of you and actually maybe even obsessively so I feel like they want to talk to you I feel it's all of these fears and anxieties they have that hold them back clearly on the back of their mind is the knight of cups okay so they do want to come to you and tell you how they feel but it could be that they're too afraid I feel like you're seeking sh uh, clarity because you look towards the clouds you're sleep you're seeking uh, clarity oh yeah look see you're seeking clarity the next card is the cross on something that is burdening you and you're very very restless and so um, <clears throat> uh, I feel like you you want to get something off your chest and you want to talk to this person about it you know like what's going on and so here is the um, the hanged man and this is them a bed um, with their negative thoughts um, we have a little demon on top of them and an angel up here above the angel is trying to get through uh, to him but he's he's not listening you know because he's he's too much in, in listening to uh, to the ghosts of the past that's where his head is and uh, so I feel like if if he could listen to his intuition he would gain clarity on what he should be doing next you know um, and so uh, we have the Sun uh, you have very little clarity on this situation but it is an indicator that you will be getting this clarity I feel like this person wants to get out of their situation they don't want to stay here 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 is not a nice place here is a very lonely place so they don't want to stay there but if they want to get out of there they have to be willing to put their heart at risk and that's the big question for them okay that's a big question for them because they've done that before and ended up with a loss a broken heart and they're still hurting from that that's the thing they're still hurting there it is right here in this moon card they're still hurting and and those are kind of like memories they'd rather forget but they keep haunting them you know still you see that they do want this with you they do want that uh, that ace of cups energy with you okay so they have some uh, very deep emotions that they are uh, trying to uh, deal with um, this is uh, about putting effort and so uh, uh, not all of these coins have uh, are finished okay so they have some information some is blank there's some blanks here so they may feel like they're missing information in order to put the effort I feel like they have that information it is within them if they would but look okay and this could have been going on for quite some time with this knight he's very very slow he does have the information that he needs um, but he must be willing to go and look at it all right he wants this new beginning with you but he must face his ghosts uh, in order to proceed is what death is saying and this is something very difficult for him look 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 how he hides he or she whoever this is how they hide their their face behind their hand no no I don't want to do it I don't want to do it that's what they're saying <laughs> it hurts too much yeah it's too difficult it's too hard that's what they're dealing with that's what they're dealing with okay but I mean they're in this position um, and it's and maybe they have set you aside but it's not because they don't love you because the ace of cups is there so and maybe they're not in love with you um, but I mean they do have some very deep feelings and they do want that ace of cups the possibility of that ace of cups is there for them okay because they feel a very special connection to you yeah see they're obsessing over they're obsessing over 
what happened to them in the past. They're obsessing over a tower moment that happened in their past. Um, and here comes another is what they're thinking. I just heard that. And here comes another. Okay, but not necessarily so. This could be a good tower that's coming. This could be one that's filled with change and positive energy. Okay, something that is very much needed in both of your lives. So you could see a surprise twist here uh, to your love story. All right. If you are not in love with this person, um, you may be, but don't yet realize it um, as well. They may be, but are not yet admitting to it or realize it or that there is potential to uh, for this to grow into love. OK, with that Ace of Cups over there. There they come right under this tower. So this is unexpected surprising news that is going to arrive that is going to change something. Okay. This is them facing their fears and that's exactly what they have to do. It's exactly what they were afraid to do up here. Look at that with their face covered. Huh. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. But if I want them, I have to do it. And so, you know, I don't want to lose this person. I have to do this and so here they come so you you uh, have not been forgotten by this person all right if they want this change there is recognition that they must get up and help themselves that's very important they must stand up on their feet there they are down here they are down and make this change this is a card of somebody who's not helping themselves Okay, okay, and, and that is exactly what death is saying needs to change, <laughs> needs to change. And the way you're going to help yourself, whoever this is, is you're going to face those fears. You're going to do what you have been running from. You have to face what you've been running from, okay, in order to uh, create change to set yourself free from that energy, you know, to escape this, this loneliness. You're struggling with that. You're so struggling with that. Oh, not you, or whoever this is, it's you or them, one or the other. Um, so afraid, they're so afraid to make a wrong choice, a bad choice, but um, they are going to do it. They are going to do it. It is necessary. They have to do it. Okay, the Wheel of Fortune is here, um, and so this is about a lesson, and so there is a lesson to take away from this uh, for this person, be it you or be it them, okay? There is a lesson in this, and it feels like a very hard one. So there's an opportunity here um, f potential here for this Ace of Cups I saw. Okay, there it is. For that Ace of Cups. Here we have the Six of Cups um, along with the Moon. So there's some feelings. I feel it's this person here. We see he's down here and he's also over here um, dealing with some issues, emotional issues, uh, repressed emotions, hurt from the past. Okay, that's what they need to deal with so they can be free to love you, so that they can open up their heart to love again. Putting this off is not fixing anything, okay? They're not fixing it by sweeping it under a rug. They're fixing it by looking at it and examining it and learning from it. That's how they fix it. Take the lesson and leave the rest behind. That's what they're meant to do. That's what they're supposed to do. And take the lesson forward. Okay? So that's what they're going to do. There you are, Aries. And look at this. <laughs> Remember I said you're looking at your options? Look what's under this. <laughs> and a choice between two people. So this is an, a, a choice between two people that you will possibly be making here in the future. There is an opportunity for love with one of these one of these options. 
okay and is one of these options who really really interests you that you really want and I feel like they are going to uh, step forward um, and step up their game <laughs> that is what I have for you I thank you for watching for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing also thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation it is greatly appreciated many blessings to all of you bye for now